Hey. It's a message for Mighty BR Powers. Because they are mighty. Excuse me. I'll put a link to his ch his or her channel in the uh, description. What is your name, Mighty? Mighty be our powers. I agree with you and disagree with you. I don't think that it was uh, when they, they removed video responses. I didn't see it as like a tyrannical thing. I think what they were doing was looking at trends. Like they hired somebody to come in and look at like what's what's popular, what's not popular, what direction should we take the site and. They saw that the video responses weren't being used as much relatively as they used to be and assumed that that meant it was a failing program. But sometimes the shit works in, in way... Like, as even as things get more popular, you'll see there there's dips and uh, peaks. And undisputably, in which I agree with you, the video response mechanism that YouTube used to have is what made that site huge. It brought so many people together. And then the people would have events and they would all hang out, wear YouTube shirts, which, you know... It's good to support the website that you use, but it's so much about functionality. Like, where can you get through to people? Where is it easiest to talk to someone? Remember Stick'em? That fucking website was amazing. What's the best chat? video chat room right now. That's what I want to go do, is go in a room with a bunch of people talking about politics. <sighs> Minds.com. We've got to get the, the best fucking no-lag chat room. Oh, I'm so excited. V, I think VR, like, I think of the future. I think I, I, a couple years, of, but I'm just, ooh, let's, do, let's video chat, man. Let's get on a, like, in a chat room or something and set up a a debate, talk about science, politics, religion, philosophy. Just like them good old days! Just like them good old days! I'm gonna get back to the delicious tomato soup, which I blended in my blender recently, um, as opposed to blending it in my shower. There's uh, probably about six tomatoes in there. Bunch of garlic, a carrot, a cucumber, and a big, huge thing of broccoli. And then I salted it with miso, and then some regular salt. You know, turmeric, cumin, and I'll show you. What I'll do is, oh, and then I use a bunch of almond milk and cashew milk to make the soup out of it. And then I put it in this huge bowl... And I have it for days. It's awesome. And it costs like... It costs like $7 to make. Or $6 to make. And it's like nine meals. It's And it's so fucking good, dude. Alright. Talk to you later.